music and you just can't help yourself. No, can you? Start going back and forth. <laughs> All right, it is time for Insomniac Theater. Rise of the Planet of the Apes was king of the box office. Coming in any disappointing <laughs> fourth place, though, was the comedy the change up. Yes, the Ryan Reynolds Jason Bateman film pulled in just 13 and a half million and it didn't get great reviews either. So how bad was it? Well, our digital news associate Jackie Fernandez hit the theater to find out and joins us now. Hi Jackie, what did you think? And I, I understand that you're ready to go back and watch it again. You loved <laughs> I am it ready that to go much. Back. Yes. <laughs> this movie stars Jason Bateman and Ryan Reynolds as two friends who are complete opposites. Bateman is a workaholic father of three and Ryan Reynolds is your typical leading ladies man and bachelor so one night after drinking they end up urinating in a fountain that just happens to Already be classy. a magical yeah, fountain key, it's super right? classy they both wish they had each other's lives and the next day when they wake up they've actually switched roles so usually in these body switching comedies hilarity ensues but in this case it <laughs> didn't okay. and this movie did not do well in the box office and that isn't hard to believe because the movie theater I saw it in was basically empty really? people were actually leaving the theater Ooh. but of the few that did see it they actually liked it so let's hear what some of those people had to say the whole movie was great I mean we love all the time yeah, it was great. Yeah, it's funny I thought it was funny I thought it was a little too long but it was a funny and entertaining movie. Ryan Reynolds and Jason Bateman kind of run off each other perfectly like everything they do how they are off screen versus how they are on screen is just synonymous. Jason Bateman, you let me down a little bit in this one. I think he could have been better. You're usually amazing. Had a lot of humor in it, and I just thought that it was quite confusing for my age group. She wasn't Aww. the only one who was confused. I was confused at how bad it was. Uh -huh. Was there yeah. a lot of flying poop? It there like was there a was lot of flying poop from the babies <laughs> into Jason Bateman's Which face. does happen, let's be honest. Yeah, but does it happen? The poop wasn't just flying. No, there was a lot. Ugh, the movie was bad. Okay. You know, um, so you I'm would guessing think the stars here, what, what are we talking about? Any? Did you give it any? I ended up giving this movie one whole star out of five. I mean... Mm. Only because they managed to complete the movie. Yes, the plot was predictable, <laughs> the stories were bad, the jokes were bad, and the humor was crude without being funny. Right, sounds well, like Jackie a pass. Fernandez, thank, thank you so much. <laughs> That's the news Thank for this you. half hour.